Today we are reviewing the Oxycare app from the Google Play Store. The Oxycare app is being reviewed using the Bluetooth control the oximeter. This is a freeware app available both for Apple and Android device. This has been tested on my Android mobile phone, Xiaomi A3. In my Control-D Bluetooth oximeter, I find in the instruction manual to use the Oxycare app. A quick search on Google will take you to the Oxycare app on the Google Play Store. The Oxycare app is a third-party app and not one which is developed by the Bluetooth makers. The Oxycare app has a 2.1 rating out of 5. Most of the people are complaining of connectivity issue. I did however find certain reviews talking about Moto 6 being compatible. I've used it on Xiaomi A3 and it has worked like a charm. Care is written with a capital O and a capital C despite of being one word along with the word pulse oximeter in bracket. Startup screen does not have any start button. You have to side scroll or side slide until you come across the start button. The app fires up with three round circle with SPO2, PI and PR written. Clicking on each of them would give you a brief description of what it means and what is deemed to be a healthy pulse rate, SPO2 level or PI level. Pressing the magnifying glass on the right hand side corner searches for the Bluetooth and connects with your oximeter Bluetooth. If you're doing the reading in the night time, you can switch off the paper by the control menu option. Once you click on the chart option on the menu on the left side, it takes you to a single screen with three broad chart. Focus on the right hand side top corner and you will see the share option. You will be able to share the log on any of the mediums as given in the screen. I've used WhatsApp in the time of my review. I think this is a convenient option to transfer your data or your log with doctors and near and dear ones. In the desktop version of WhatsApp, download the file. It's an Excel file and open it on Microsoft Excel and see your log on a computer screen. Final word, it's a third party app. It connects beautifully on Android platform. Screen is a larger display for SPO2, perfusion index and pulse rate. The beeper can be switched on and off for night reading. If your phone's Bluetooth is switched off, once you switch on the app, it automatically switches on the Bluetooth and searches for your oximeter Bluetooth and gets paired. This is a great feature keeping in mind that the oximeter will be used by elders and it's not always easy to carry out the Bluetooth pairing, especially for elders. The log is a one-time reading log which can be transferred. The oximeters do not come with a memory card so it can only record from switch on to switch off. But if you want to keep multiple logs, you have to consistently keep downloading the logs. 